it's day two of the five day challenge, talking about finding, securing and making the ideal client love your firm. As I was saying yesterday, uh, there's a lot of conversation around valuable clients. But if you look at your top 30, are those valuable clients your ideal clients? Do you love them? Do they love you? Do you look forward to talking to them? Are they easy to work with? Do they um, stay loyal to you? Or actually, are they energy sapping, time wasting? They may be valuable, but they may not be your ideal client. And that doesn't look to a sustainable firm for the future, does it? So day two, let's think about really defining your ideal client. I think we all talk about our niche, who we target, but really think about what that means for you. If you're in property, for instance, if that's who you target, the property industry, then what type of business is that? What are their pain points? What are their problems? What solutions do you have for them? Go and look at your website, look at your social media, all of the posts that you put out there. Is it actually obvious who you're talking to? Because what you really need to do is talk to them directly, talk to them about issues that they're interested in, talk to them about their pain points. Because if you don't, you will just get people coming and wasting your time. They won't understand why they need you. They won't understand the benefits. So look at your website, for instance, go through it. Does it make sense? Would somebody, uh, the ideal client, be able to identify themselves and self-select? That is the question for day two. Have a look and think about it.